actually are looking at the entire care process, which is sitting down with the patient, understanding their pain, understanding their long-term needs, indeed signing an agreement, but also following them closely with pain scales and getting risk assessment tools completed. That whole care process, we believe, improves the care of the patients, makes them feel more secure in having a reliable way to have their pain managed. We believe that our findings suggest that enrollment of patients in controlled substance agreements and having a care process model around the management of chronic non-cancer pain can improve the care of patients who have chronic pain and are receiving opioids. This video content is copyrighted by Mayo Foundation for Medical Education and Research.